Hello, hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening, my dear class. How are you? Hi. I have, uh, Hi. So, so, I have, hello. I have the problem. Good evening. What happened? What is the problem? In my house, no, I lose. <laughs> <laughs> Y tengo de carga solo 21. Entonces, por eso se ve todo oscuro. <ríe> ya ven, vea, eso es, eso es como el extra sí. mile de mis estudiantes. ¿Cómo no hacer un buen maestro uno si tengo estudiantes que se me conectan sin luz? Ay. <ríe> Aquí es lo viendo que tan fuertes son mis datos del teléfono. <ríe> well, Stephanie, that's good. So, eh, as you don't have anything to show on the camera and you don't have electricity, uh, maybe for you to save some uh, battery, turn off the camera. <laughs> Creo que puedes apagar la cámara porque igual estamos viendo como... Lo nada. <laughs> Lo nada. Pero eh, para que te aguante un poquito más la batería, quizás vale. la puedes la puede apagar. <laughs> Y cerrar todas las aplicaciones para que ninguna te, te, te coma más batería. Ok, ok. Cuando Stephanie desaparezca y oh, vamos a saber que se acabaron los 21%. Y ya que ven. no vino la luz. Ya ven la importancia de tener una batería portátil, vea. Uh -huh. Pero ¿qué pasa cuando uno tiene una batería portátil? Se le olvida cargar la batería. It's exactly. Exactly like that. Well, my dear students, welcome to another day, another class. Thank you very much for your beautiful messages. I really like them. Thank you for being so special with me. I really appreciate. I good day, teacher. Yeah, I was. Thank you very uh -huh. much. I was receiving a lot of beautiful messages on, on the chat. That was very beautiful. No, I said, cuanto amor, I said. That was very nice. Well, my dear class, today we are going to go over the platform to see if we have completed everything. And we are also going to, uh, we're also going to work a little bit on present continuous forms for us to finish the topic. And I am going to answer questions. If you have any doubt about tomorrow's presentation, tomorrow is your day to present and it's going to be very beautiful. You will see, it will be a very beautiful day. And let's start with the platform. Many of you have already completed everything on the platform, but it is always good for us to go back and review. And so you can uh, check if you are leaving, for example, any exercise with one or two mistakes, right? This is the moment for you to complete it. And that's what we are going to do to start the class. And let me share my screen because this is a little bit slow today, but I'm going to share it here with you. Te puedo compartir pantalla? Gracias. Okay, there you go. So, hello, yeah. hello. Good, evening. Good, evening. good evening. Good evening, sweetie, hello. So based on the progress that we should have had, we should be done with unit number five. So unit number five shouldn't be a problem for us right now. Most of you already completed and most of you already complete the evaluations. Here we have unit number five that it's basically about present continuous, right? Right. Here, we're going to go over the exercises for you to check them. Ya todos la tienen terminada, eso ya es por seguro que todo ya está listo para este momento. In this part, we have the time, right? We have the time. This was quite a challenge for many of you. We were working on this before. And for this part of it, we have to choose different times 
and the problem was that you were choosing only one. Estaban escogiendo solo una respuesta. Y ese era el mayor problema. Right? And in this one, here you have two options. What time is it in the first picture? You have the answers right here. Four past 11. <gasps> In the first, in the first picture. No, no. It's 10. 20 after 2. It's 20 after 2. Niña. Niña. Is it? Perdón. Y pistola ahorita. ¿Qué pasó conmigo? Okay, it's 20 past 2, right? Or it's 20 after 2 or it's 2.20. Good. So this is the first picture. The two options is 20 after two, it's 220, right? You have to choose two. In the next one, here you have, it is 10 to seven, right? It is 10 to seven. And the other yeah. option was it's 650, 650, right? Uh -huh. 650. Pero si no escogía las dos opciones, no le daba paso. Y le salía, malo, malo, malo. Y dice la, la plataforma, no sé qué, qué memo, la que qué mala, que no sé qué. Y el error era eso. <laughs> that was a problem, a little problem that we were having with the platform. In this one, you have, it is a quarter to nine. nine. A quarter to nine or it's 8.45. 45. In this so, one, it is 11.05 11 or it's five past 11. Right? This was the problem here. And this was completed. In this one, it is 3.15 three. or it is a quarter past three. Mm -hmm. A quarter past three. And in the last one, it is half past four, que eran las 4.30, or it is 4.30. Four. And there you have the exercise totally complete, right? In the second part of this one, the second exercise that you had on this area was about the intonation. I explained you this before. Okay, eso ya se lo había explicado antes. Que las preguntas de yes, no are rising and the WH questions are falling. Okay, let's practice the, converse, the conversation, the sentences right now. Practice with me. Are you wearing a coat? I read, are you I wearing, wearing a coat? You coat? Are you wearing a coat? Are you wearing a coat? What are you doing now? What are you doing now? What time is it? What time is it? Is it midnight? Is it midnight? Is it midnight? Is it midnight? What color is his t-shirt? What color is his t-shirt? What color is his t-shirt? His t-shirt. His t-shirt, no, right? What color is his t-shirt? It's like color, color, color página. Are you from Thailand? Are you from Thailand? Are you from Thailand? Are you from Thailand? Thailand. Thailand. Very good. Thailand. Thailand. And here you have the intonation of the questions. Wait, I need to share my audio. If not, you are not going to listen anything. There you go. Siempre enfrente de los niños. There you go. Anyway. Funciones, no funciones, yes, no. Hmm. Pues a veces queda el sonido y si lo reinicia se le pierden todas las respuestas. I know, no I know. La barra espaciadora. I die. <laughs> One. Are you wearing a coat? Are you wearing a coat? Two. What are you doing now? What are you doing now? What are you doing now? Three. What time is it? Four. Is it midnight? Five. What color is his t shirt? Six. Are you from Thailand? 
are you from Thailand, right? So this was the rising and falling intonation. In this one, you have to answer questions about the pictures. Yesterday, we were practicing the present continuous, right? Here, you have people doing different activities. Here, in the case, the first picture, what is the name of the lady in the first picture? Victoria. Okay, Victoria. her name is? Her name Victoria. is Victoria. Her name, her name is Victoria. Victoria. What Victoria. is Victoria doing? She is sleeping. She is sleeping. sleeping, right? She is sleeping. Where is she right now? Los Angeles. She is in Los Angeles, right? She is in Los Angeles. What time is it in Los Angeles? 4 a.m. It's 4 a.m., right? It's 4 a.m. What is his name? The boy in the Marcos. second picture. His name. His name is Marcos. His name is Marcos. The next one. Where is Marcos right now? Uh, <laughs> no, but if, but if I say where, where? Where in pajamas? Listen, listen to the question. Where is Marcos right now? Mexico. In, in Mexico. Mexico City. He is Mexico. Ah. He is Mexico City. He is Mexico City or he is in Mexico City? Eh, Mexico, City. Mexico City. Mexico City. Mexico City. Ah, okay, porque si decimos he is Mexico City, por aquí está yes. Guadalajara, Guanajuato, right? No, he is in Mexico City, porque él no es México, right? He is in Mexico. What time is it in Mexico? Seven, six, seven, eight, 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 six, six a.m. Six a.m. And what is Marcos wearing? He is wearing, he's wearing, wearing pajamas. pajamas. He's wearing pajamas, right? He's wearing pajamas. He's wearing pajamas. Ah, uh, striped pajamas, right? So you say a stripe. A stripe is rayadas. I am going to send it on the chat. Lo voy a mandar al chat. Stripes. 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 What are the names of the two people Stripes. on the next picture? What are the names? Their, their name. They are Susan and the, Tom. The Will and Tom. Um, Tom have his dinner. Okay. Sue and Tom. Sue and Tom. Um, are having breakfast or dinner? Are having breakfast. dinner. Breakfast. Dinner. Breakfast. Seven. Uh, breakfast. Seven. It's seven a.m. New York City. Eating breakfast. Uh -huh. Seven a.m. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Attention. Mm -hmm. It's seven in the morning. They cannot be having dinner. They are having yeah. breakfast. breakfast. They are having breakfast where? They are having breakfast. Where are in, they right now? Where? In New York in City. New York City. In, in New, York, New City. York City, right? They are having breakfast in New York City. They are drinking tea, right? They are drinking. No, they are <laughs> drinking. They are drinking coffee. They are drinking. Drink, coffee. And drink, drinking coffee. Are, they are drinking yeah. coffee. E eating eggs, right? Eating eggs and reading the newspaper. What about Celia? Where is Celia right now? In Brasilia. She's Brasilia. in Brasilia, right? She's, She's in Brasilia. Brasilia. She's in Brasilia. What time She's is in it Brasilia. in Brasilia? Nine. 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 Nine a.m. What is Celia doing? She is shopping, uh, going to work. She is shopping. Uh, shopping. Uh, she is going to the bank. She is going to the bank or she is going to work. We never know, right? She is going to work. 
Tell me, what is Celia wearing? ¿Qué está usando? What is Celia is wearing? Wearing suit. She's wearing a suit. She's wearing a suit. If you say, if you say, she's wearing a suit, es que anda puesto un dulce. <laughs> it's suit. not possible. She's wearing <laughs> a suit, right? She's wearing, She's wearing a, suit. a suit. Very good. Uh, what about James and Anne? Where are James and Anne right now? Where it's are London. they? They are, in London. Where, they are uh, in London, right? They are, they in, are London. in London. What time is it in London? It's 11 o'clock. It's, it's noon. Twelve. Twelve o'clock. It's twelve. It's noon. It's noon, noon right? Oh, it's noon. noon. And what are they doing? If it is noon, they are. Almost breakfast. No? They are no. taking the bird. Yeah. The... They are having the lunch. 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 They, are, lunch. they are drinking tea lunch. for sure, right? Ha, ha, ha. Yeah. They are drinking tea. Here in El Salvador, coffee with hojitas, but they're in London, tea and cookies. Una sola con cookies. <laughs> hey. A ver, Víctor no nos dejará mentir. Víctor debe saber. Víctor. Chilate con nuega. <laughs> Chilate con nuegas. Imagine. Chuco donde niña Tere. Ajá. Imagínense vivir en London y perderse las hojitas. <laughs> so for sure. Okay. They are eating, and we have at the beginning of the morning you eat breakfast, right? Then at noon you eat lunch. At night you eat dinner. In the middle of the of the day you eat. Snacks, right? You eat snacks. This is not a snake, okay? A snake is culebra. Don't say, I am eating a snake. <laughs> I am eating a snack. Okay, snack son los entre comidas, los boquitas, un churrito, alguna cosa que se come ahí entre comidas. Okay, so that is uh, the definition, right? Breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack. It, this is not diner, okay? This is dinner. 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 And here we have Andre. What is Andre doing? He's working. 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 In Moscow. He's working in Moscow. 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 What time is it in Moscow? 3 p.m. 3 p.m. 3 p.m. Tell me, is Victoria happy? Is Victoria happy? Yes. Is Victoria happy? Yes. 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 Very happy. She is happy. She's asleep. Happy. Sure. She's happy. She's happy. happy. Victoria. Happy. Okay, she's I'm sleeping. sleeping. She's, she's, she's swimming. <laughs> Yo creo que Madeline quiere ir a la playa. Desde ayer anda nada. No, es que me confundo porque los dos comienzan con S y, y se me traba ahí. Sleeping. Sleeping. Se le traba la carreta. Es como... El hamster. What about Sue and Tom? Are they happy? Yes, they yes. are happy. Yes. James, they are. James and Anne. Yes, yes, they are yes, happy they, too. They are happy. They are happy too. They are. They are happy too. They are happy. They are happy. They are very elegant. As you can see. They are Thanks. For sure. They are in this. Yes. They are, they are very elegant. And what about Andre? Is Andre happy? No, no. I don't know. No, he, no, no. he's not. He's he not serious. He's serious. He's not serious. He's serious. He's serious. He's serious. He's serious. I think that's the answer. He's stressed. He's, he's, 
He's Pre stressed. Preocupa. Worried. What do you say? Okay. Preocupado. Worried. 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 I am going to send it on the chat. He is worried <laughs> because he he, he needs to worried. give the report. Worried. Right? He's worried. Worried. And he is. Worried. He is under worried. stress. Stress. He is under stress. It's like él está bajo mucho estrés. Or you say he is stressed. Presión. He's stressed. If he is under pressure, like the song. Under pressure. Is in English? Under pressure. Yeah. Your question. Yes. Pregúnteme, Jonathan. ¿Cómo? ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre la pronunciación entre estrés y estrés? Así como escribió. Ah, you say stress and stressed. Stress. Sí. At the end, stressed. Stress. Okay, uh, be prepared. Be yeah. prepared. Yo ya les dije, vayan investigando ya sus amigos en el past tense porque les van a servir. Pero ese es un adjetivo, right? Stressed and stressed. It's an adjective. Okay. Stress. Stressed with D at stress. the end. Stress. Okay. So based on this one. Here we have the questions that I was doing. Okay, esa es una pregunta que les estaba haciendo y les agregué muchas más. Pero, what is Marcos wearing? He's wearing pajamas. Who is having breakfast? Sue and Tom are having breakfast. The complete answer, right? What is Celia wearing? She is wearing a suit. Why are James and Anne having lunch? Because it is noon. Where is Andre working? He's working in Moscow. He's working in Moscow in Moscow, right? And the final evaluations that we have here, here we had uh, the next one. The next one was about the sounds, right? Estos nos dieron duro allá todos, pero todos sobrevivimos a los sonidos, right? In this one, you have to choose <laughs> different sounds for you to okay, write down the action that was taking place. Here you have many options to do it, and the first one, you say she is driving or only driving, right? You can have both cases, right? She's driving, swimming, eating, watching TV, dancing, riding a bike. And the last ones, we have playing tennis and typing. Many people didn't know the last one. Okay, a muchos se les dificultó la última. ¿Por qué? Porque... Quizás el 50% de aquí no ha tomado clases de mecanografía. Ajá. Ah. Oh, 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 did it. A ver, ¿quién tomó clases de yo mecanografía? Sí. Yo sí. Yo. Ok, los otros dirán, ¿qué es eso? ¿Qué es eso? En... Los millennials. Los millennials. Los millennials. Los Indeed, it was very necessary for you to type in the computer in a good form, okay? Muchos de los que sí tomaron mecanografía pueden escribir rápido en la compu. And they are like, chuch, chuch, chuch. very good. If not, only with two finger, right? Like in some cases, me, it's like pick up pollo, right? Because we didn't, we didn't have that ability to type as we used to have in the typing in the typing machine, right? Janet, tell me. Um, en esta, a mí se me generó la duda, teacher, porque en el primer video decía de que se tendría que escribir como el nombre de la persona, uh -huh. pero ya hay una opción para hacer la respuesta, se tenía que ir con she. He or she, ajá. Uh -huh. Ajá, ahí se me generó a mí la, du la duda, por eso tuve un poco de problemas para, para ir respondiendo, porque como el video decía que se, que se hacía por el nombre, se mencionaba el nombre cuando ya estaba, pero ya en la respuesta tenía que ir con Shear. Shear, en ese uh -huh. sentido, ¿cómo, en ese sentido, ¿cómo es eh, lo correcto? Both things are correct. Si ya le da el nombre a la pregunta, puede responder con el nombre, en, ya en una forma oral, ¿ves? En este caso, la plataforma daba la opción de escribir eh, solamente el verbo o si era mujer o hombre la que estaba tomando ahí, la que estaba haciendo la actividad. 
Pero lo correcto es en ambos casos. Puede ser, por ejemplo, what is the teacher doing? Ah, the teacher is eh, giving the class or she is giving the class. And the two forms are going to be correct. Okay? Las dos maneras van a estar correctas si usted corresponde de, de la, cualquiera de las dos maneras. No problem. Okay? But in writing, you okay. can say she. ¿Por qué en writing a veces lo cambiamos? Para no volver a ocupar el nombre. Y así ocupamos un pronombre para sustituirlo. Para no decir, what is Mary doing? Mary is eating. Mary is cooking. Y no vamos a estar repitiendo Mary, Mary, Mary todo el tiempo. Tal vez para hacer como una opción de evitar la repetición. Puede usarlo con she. En, ya con su forma escrita. There you have the, the option. Okay. So, and the last activity that you had here, and it's the one that we are going to use as the last exercise, is the reading, right? You had a reading on this one, and on the reading you had two people writing or chatting, and for sure we are going to listen to it, and we're going to read it as well. Here you have the audio for it. Yes. Reading. Friends across a continent. Meg Martin and Kathy O'Brien chat online almost every day. Meg is an exchange student from the U.S. She is studying in Mexico. Kathy is in the U.S. Hi there. Hi, Meg. What are you doing? I'm sitting on my bed with my laptop computer. I'm doing my homework. What are you working on? I'm writing an essay for Spanish class. Can you chat? For a minute. Where are you? I'm in an internet cafe with my friend Carmen. I'm having coffee and she's reading a magazine. How is your family? They're all fine. My father's working outside. He's mowing the lawn. My mother is out shopping. Where's your brother? John's not home. He's playing soccer in the park. Oh, wait. My mother is home. She's calling me. I have to go. Okay, bye. 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 Okay, bye. Well, two of them are chatting, right? What is Katie doing? What is Katie doing on the computer? She is cheating. Um, 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 no, what is she doing no. on the computer? Is your homework? She is cheating. Uh -huh. yeah, she... I am doing my homework. I am doing my homework, right? She... I am doing. I am doing my homework. My homework. What? What is the homework about? What is the homework about? De qué se trata la tarea? Uh, class. Spanish, Spanish class. Spanish class. She's writing what? She's writing an essay. What is an essay? Es un ensayo. Right? She's writing an essay for the Spanish class. So she's working in an essay for the Spanish class. That is what she's doing in the computer, right? She's sitting on the bed with the laptop and she's writing an essay in, for the Spanish class. And what about Meg? What is Meg doing? ¿Qué anda haciendo Meg en este caso? 
Working. Uh, here is an internet cafe. <laughs> With she, she is an internet cafe or she is in an internet cafe? In an internet cafe. She is in an internet cafe. With whom? With her friend. With whom? With her friend, Carmen. That is maybe a new question for you. Se la voy a enviar al chat. And it says, with whom? With whom? Quien? Con quien? With whom? With whom? With whom? Con quien? With whom? With whom? With her friend, Carmen. With her friend, Carmen. With I, let's see. Jancy, are you with more people in your house? Yes, I am. With whom? With my mother and my two sisters. So that's the use of the question. With whom? Con quien? Imagine if you call me and say, like, hello, teacher Nati, how are you? And it's like, hi, how are you? I am in Metro Centro. Hey, what are you doing? Shopping. With whom? With my mother. Come. Hey. Okay, that's the question. With whom? Con quien? The next one. Let's see. Do you know the meaning of mowing the lawn? Mowing the lawn? Mowing the lawn. What is, uh, where is lawn? Lawn. What is the meaning of mowing the lawn? It's cortar la grama, pero con máquina, con una podadura. Here in El Salvador with the machete, right? <laughs> Here, that is cutting the grass. Si lo haces con machete o con otra máquina que solo la arranca o la corta, it's cutting. Pero mowing es podar la grama. Mowing the lawn. The lawn. The lawn es el pasto. The lawn. Mowing the lawn. Pasto. El pasto. And John, it's the name of the brother, right? John is a brother de Mel. Uh -huh. It's brother of Katie. Because, brother Meg, Katie. Uh, because Meg is the one that says, where is your brother? Meg le pregunta, ¿dónde está tu hermano? Y viene oh, Katie okay. y le dice, John is not at home. And no John, casa. John, is John is not no home. Está. Like, no está en casa. No está. He's not home, you say. No está en casa. And where is the mother? The mother is home. Is home. Is home. Is home. Is home. In home. In home. My mother is home, right? She's calling me. But where was the mother before? Donde andaba la mamá antes? Shopping. 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 She was shopping, shopping, right? Very good. Shopping. She was shopping. And she what is Carmen doing? Uh, read a machine. Read. Reading. Uh, read, reading, reading a magazine. Reading a magazine. Reading a magazine. Very magazine. good job. What is the Yo meaning of magazine? Revista. What, what is, is Carmen doing? What is Carmen doing? Um, that is the question. She is reading a magazine. So, who oh, is see. who is writing an essay? Mm -hmm. ¿Quién está escribiendo el, el ensayo? Who is writing? Eh, Katy. Katy O'Brien. Katy O'Brien. Katy O'Brien. Katy. Katy O'Brien. Katy. Katy O'Brien. Katy. In the United States, it's Katy. Here in El Salvador, Katy. Katy. Katy O'Brien. Katy O'Brien. Who is having coffee? Eh, Meg Martin. Meg Martin, right? Who is reading a magazine? Carmen. Carmen. Carmen, right? Carmen. With the cadenita. Who is working outside? The father. 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 Who is shopping? Mother. 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 And who is playing soccer? John O'Brien. John O'Brien is playing soccer. And then you go for sure with your 
complete answers. And that is the end of the platform. What is missing here? What is missing here? My friends, the exams. But I have them answered for you. Ya los tengo listos. We had uh, different people talking about uh, personal information and we had about Justin that she is from Canada. What is Mike like? According to the conversation, he is a little quiet, but very funny. What is the weather like? It is rainy, but it's warm. And is Sue wearing a blue dress? No, she is oh, not. She is not. She's, She's wearing, wearing a, a suit. suit. A suit. A suit. A suit. A suit. <laughs> Con un dulce de toffee aquí. <laughs> She's wearing a suit. In this case, we had some problems here to write the questions. Creo que estaban agarrando la pregunta de la siguiente y ese era el problema. And in this one. No, they are not from England. Si ya me está diciendo que no son de Inglaterra, for sure, la pregunta tiene que ser, are you from England? Are they from England? Because they say they. Are they from England? No, they are not. They are from Australia. We are from New York. Where are you from? Uh, we are from New York. I think she is 22. How old is she? No, my first language isn't Spanish. Is your first language Spanish? No, my first language is not Spanish. And yes, I am Japanese. Are you Japanese? And it says, yes, I am Japanese. I am from Tokyo, right? Here on the next one before the attendance, antes de que me vaya a la asistencia. What is the contrary of serious? What is the opposite of serious? Funny. 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 The opposite of serious is funny. Funny. Jane is a really good student. She is very smart. smart. Smart, right? She is very smart. My teacher isn't short. She is tall. 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 Right? Tall. Tall. Yeah. <laughs> she is very tall. My brother is good looking. He is. Handsome. handsome. He's handsome. What is handsome? Handsome. Like Brad Pitt, for example. He's guapo. Ah, guapo. Well, in the moment, right? He, he was handsome. Ahorita si le pregunta a cualquier chica, un niño guapo, algún BTS. He's handsome. He's handsome. Okay, good. I am going to call the attendance y ahí termino con los últimos tres exámenes que nos faltan. Le voy a pasar asistencia antes de que nada suceda. Y no va a ser que vaya la luz. ¿verdad? Nadie vino. No, no, teacher, I am there. Ok, here I go. Remember when you listen to your beautiful name, say here or present. Let's go. I am going to open my document. And I will start. Let's see. Stephanie Guadalupe. Here. Thank you. Janet Rosibel. Here. Thank you. Jonathan Fernando. Present teacher. Jose Daniel Valdizón. Present. Thank you. Jose Eduardo Mengíbar. Present. Jose Wilfredo Coreas. Jose Wilfredo. Eh, Juan Pablo Guzmán. Present. Carla Sofía. Carla Sofía. Laura Lisset. Miss Laura. Madeline Rocío. Present. Thank you. María del Carmen. María Elena. Present. Mary Guadalupe. Thank you, Mary. Yeah. Se me activó su micrófono por ahí medio. Medio le vi. Moises Antonio. Here. Nancy Jocelyn. Nancy. 
Nancy, ¿dónde estás? Acabo de ver a Nancy aquí, se me perdió. Ok. Eh, Osmilda Claribel. Present teacher. Paola Lucía. Here teacher. Regina Guadalupe. Regina Guadalupe. Eh, Ricardo Alexander. Present. Ronald Ernesto. Mr. Present. Ronald, thank you. Present. Rosa María Miguel. Here, teacher. Thank you. Rosy Natalie. Rosy Natalie. Eh, Ruth Daniela. Present, teacher. Sofía Geraldine. Sofía Geraldine. Ok. Eh, Víctor Alfredo. Víctor, se nos durmió ahora. ¿Qué pasó? Xiomar sí, Elizabeth. Present teacher. Yancy Yamilet. Present teacher. Yesenia Beatriz. Present teacher. En Zulma Mercedes. Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you very much. I am missing. No me mencionó, teacher. Oscar Antonio. Oscar Antonio Ramos. Ahí está. Presente. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's the importance, you see. Ya ven, por eso no me enamoro. <laughs> One, two, three, four, let's see, five, six, seven, eight, eight students missing. So am I missing anyone else? Okay, <clears throat> good. So let's continue, my dear students. Let's continue here. I was showing you, for sure, the last two exams that we are missing. Nos quedan dos exámenes nada más por completar para que toda la plataforma esté completa y todo esté totalmente revisado. Here, answer the question. Say, like, we did this exercise in class. And it says, is this Sue's scarf? No, it is not hers. It is mine. Whose boots are these? Maybe they are Katie's, you say. Are these Lisa's gloves? Yes, they are hers. Maybe, maybe they are. Maybe they are Katie's. They are, Katie. Katie's. are these Lisa's gloves? Yes, they are hers. Whose hat is this? De quien es este sombrero? I think it's yours. Are Peter and Katie's coats? No, they aren't theirs. They are ours. No son de ellos. Son nuestros son nuestros and in this one it says are you wearing jeans no i am wearing a suit is mr sims wearing a tie no he isn't wearing a tie right in this one you have to be very careful because you have to choose the answer that matches the uh, the answer correctly because it says no he is wearing a tie no tiene not. No, he is not. Y la segunda opción era no, I am not. Y estamos hablando de he. Entonces no es posible. Y la última, no, he isn't wearing a tie is the complete and correct answer. Are Ed and Sue wearing sweaters? No, they are not because you are talking about two people. It's very hot. Is it raining? No, it's not raining. It's snowing. One day we are going to say that in El Salvador. Así como ve el clima. We never know. And these ones, los amigos que ya vimos anteriormente. Nuestros amigos los relojes. Two options, right? También en esta. Two options of them. Remember, the friend, the times, right? In this one, you only have three. And in the last evaluation, I think it's this one, right? This is the last evaluation. So when you finish with everything, you need to go here. Se van aquí donde dice progreso, por favor. Todos, ahorita que ya la terminaron, no. se van ahí donde dice progreso. Y le va a salir sus barritas. O sea, ustedes le van a salir completas todas. Yo porque les he ido explicando algunos ejercicios. 
no las tengo, <ríe> no las tengo todas terminadas porque yo les he ido explicando así ejercicios específicos. Su barra tiene que verse todas las barras rojitas y la barra esta que tiene rojo y gris. Y me va a decir, ¿por qué tiene dos colores, teacher? Porque ahí va incluido su nota final y su nota total de las barritas. ¿Ok? Hasta esa pregunta es, es buena de aclarar. Entonces, esta barrita tiene que tener el 100% y todas las demás en 100%. Y esa, sí, teacher, esa barrita gris final, así tiene que quedar en gris. Sí. ¿Por qué? Porque ya terminó el examen final al 100%. Ah, okay. las, las clases ah. no se miden aquí, ¿verdad? No. Las clases, las clases obviamente, clases, sí. yo les llevo su asistencia y todo porque yo la tomo y de ahí yo la, la reporto, queda grabada en video. Por eso siempre les digo, siempre digan here or present. O algunos que solo me levantan la manita y yo les digo, ya lo vi, ya levanto la mano. Entonces ahí lo reporto. Siempre cuento cuántos me faltan de asistencia y comparo con cuántos están presentes para que hagamos el match. Entonces todo queda eh, documentado. Así no hay donde perderse. Hay, hay que, que mandar un mensaje, ¿verdad? Ajá. Diciendo que, que no, no se tomaban en cuenta en las barras y que si no estábamos en tanto por ciento, no podíamos optar al otro módulo. Exactamente. ¿Por qué? Porque la asistencia se lleva ya en un documento específico con ellos aparte y por eso yo todos los días, ahí fervientemente les tomo asistencia y todos dicen, here, present, here, here. Y ahí yo llego el Pero reporte. Es que el porcentaje que llevan ellos. Así es. Llevamos un documento Ese... en común. Ellos comparan con video y asistencia. Como Zoom guarda una lista de a qué hora usted entró, a qué hora se salió, cuántos minutos estuvo. Entonces, para que a ustedes les sirven sus próximos módulos también en llevar ese cuidado. ¿Quién tenía la cámara? ¿Quién no tenía la cámara? Entonces, todo eso se mide. Todo eso se puede eh, ver. En, el, en cuestión de video, porque yo igual les subo las clases, ustedes las han visto, sus clases ahí quedan grabadas y no hay, ahí no hay, está todo clear as water, no clear as, or, as horchata, it's clear as water, ahí todo queda clarito, nadie me dice, yo estuve teacher, yo fui, y no aparece ni en video, ni en la lista, ni en la cámara, so it's, it's difficult, It's difficult. Y es, es por eso. ¿Por qué se le solicita que tengan la cámara encendida? Porque cuando su cámara está encendida, estamos seguros de que está enfocado en lo que estamos haciendo. ¿ya? No anda por allá paseando al gato allá en la calle. ¿Qué dijo Tichet a ti? ¿Qué? ¿Qué? <ríe> Esa es la importancia del de, eh, video. Esa es la importancia de la cámara. Eh, igual, si tienen dificultades con la cámara, vayan consiguiendo ahí aunque sea una de esas que se le pone a la, al telefonito o que se le pone a la laptop, para que le sirva y ustedes puedan tener sus clases sin ningún problema. ¿Okay? Este fue el consejo del día. Dígame. Yo envié, eh, cuando envié la primera documentación, cuando envié la documentación para el primer módulo, me respondieron donde confirmo recibido. Ahora envié la segunda información, cabal de el último día, porque eran tres días, ¿verdad? Ajá. El último día y no me han respondido. Si, si ok, han... Volvamos, a, volvamos a poner el mensaje, se lo puede volver a reenviar a todos los que no les han respondido, pero estén pendientes también de su correo. Revisen su correo, revisen spam, cuando veces que se les haya ido a spam ahí, para que estemos pendientes de todo, ¿ok? We are going to do the last exercise of the night. Vamos a hacer el último ejercicio de esta noche que se los tenía listo por aquí. This is the one that we did yesterday, right? Este fue el último con el que terminamos ayer. This is the one that we did on the platform. Este ya lo hicimos en la plataforma. And here I only have three more people, right? On the platform you have these ones, right? And here we have a, a person in Bangkok, a person in Tokyo, and a person in your city. It says you. This is for you. What time is it in your city, people? What time is it in your city right now? It's, it's, it's nine. It's nine. It's nine fifty two. It's nine fifty two. It's nine fifty two. Right? Or fifty three. It's ten to ten. 
<laughs> well, it's eight to ten. ten. Nine, ten. Eight to ten. It's, it's nine fifty-two. It's ten to ten. Right now, nobody is sleeping. Nobody is having breakfast. Nobody is working. But you are studying, right? As you are doing different things, I have some friends here in the picture. I need you to analyze the picture and tell me what is the problem with the picture? What is happening on the picture that you consider that is not normal? Wearing in no appropriado para la actividad que están haciendo. <laughs> they are not wearing the appropriate clothes. But uh, what can you tell me? What can you tell me about the different people? What can you tell me about Bob and Ling? They, they are playing. playing they, they are wearing in offices. Uh, they, they are wearing office uh, suits and they are playing tennis with umbrella. umbrellas. Uh, umbrella. They are playing tennis with umbrellas. umbrellas. What about Mr. Frank? Mr. Frank. <laughs> the tiger is driving. driving. Mr. Frank. The tiger is driving, right? Uh, He's driving in. Reading and he's very normal reading the reading newspaper. newspaper. He's reading the newspaper and he's sitting. Where is he sitting? He's on, on the car. 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 What is what is Ellen doing? Ellen is swimming. <laughs> Doing swimming. 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 Hoy sí, hoy sí, Madeline. Ellen is swimming. Hoy me equivoqué. Hoy sí, hoy sí. Detengan todo, detengan todo. Te quiero Madeline. estar diciéndolo. Madeline, what is Ellen doing? <laughs> swimming. She's swimming. She's swimming. <laughs> what? I'm sleeping, pensé que... <laughs> well, Peter, Peter is sleeping under the rain. In the rain. <laughs> he, yes. He is sleeping under the rain. What about Randy and Mark? Uh, Randy and Mark. 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 In the river, they're rather. Oh, they are okay. This is good. This is a good thing. They are riding on the lagoon. They are riding on the, on the lagoon. Yeah, this, the is lagoon. Lagoon. this is a little lagoon. This is a lagoon. Okay. Or I think the correct name for this one is not a lagoon. Porque una laguna ya es mucho más grande. Este es un charco. Charco. Pond. <laughs> un charco. It's a pond. 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 Ese es un charquito de agua. A pond. And what about Anna? What is the problem with Anna? Anna uh, is, is running in the shoes. Running, running in the world. He's running. ¿Cómo se llamaban los tacones? Teacher. Uh, high heels. Running. High heels. Uh -huh. uh, She's running with high running. heels. High heels. High heels. Uh, and she is carrying, carrying the back. The back. back. What no. is the name of that? Purse. No, lo vimos cuando estábamos estudiando allá las ubicaciones. A briefcase. Very good. No, purse es una cartera normal, right? That's a purse. But this is a briefcase. Briefcase. Esta ahí está para ti, Juan. Very good. It's a briefcase, right? This is a briefcase. What happens with the dressing? For sure, you said that uh, Bob and Ling have office clothes, right? Ellen is swimming with a suit. Anna is wearing a sweatshirt, right? A sweatshirt and pants. And this picture is really crazy. Mrs. Smith, Mrs. Smith, what is the problem with Mrs. Smith? Um, we, uh, suit. 
She's he, wearing she's wearing a suit. He's was in the, was in the umbrella. Sin lluvia, como she she is using the umbrella without rain, right? She is using the umbrella without rain. And here you have she is el sol because some sun y el sol para protegerse. And she is wearing boots. Ah, boots. Boot. 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 Now I need you please to write. Escriban ahí en su cuaderno. Three sentences about what you can see in this picture here. En esta foto de aquí. What is the problem? Choose three sentences. El chucho con palio chino. It's very picky, pero los puedo ocupar. Eso estaba viendo que mejor lo gusta. Yeah. It's, it's very Me Cocinando, la cocina en la tele. Yes. Que es Apple, eso. And she, look what, what she's cooking. Miren lo que está cocinando. Pulpo. Octopus. She's cooking octopus. Octopus. I am going to send it on the chat. Octopus. She's cooking octopus. Cooking octopus. On television. On the television. She's on cooking the, on octopus the, on the television. Octopus. Teacher, how do you say yeleras in English? Cooler. I am going to send it on the chat. It's cool. Cool is like fresco, right? Cool. And el objeto para mantenerlo fresco is cooler. Cooler. Yeah. How, you do you say, how do you say palio chin? Ah, very good question. Chopsticks. Chopsticks. Chops Sticks. Chopsticks. Chopsticks. It's on the chat. Chopsticks. 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 I need a volunteer to tell me the sentence. Teacher, uh, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, a dog eats pizza and chopsticks. Uh -huh. Let's make the sentence complete. Here, you say the dog. The dog. The dog. The dog. Y necesitamos el verbo. Is el verbo to be. De ahí el verbo en present continuous. Is mm -hmm. eating pizza oui. with. Chopsticks. Okay. The dog is eating pizza with chopsticks, right? Ahí tenemos sujeto, verbo to be, eh, verbo en ing, and the complement. The yes? family is eating a large pizza. The family is eating a large pizza. Very good. They are, pajamas, pajamas. They, they are wearing pajamas. Very good. Madeline? She is cooking octopus on the TV. She is cooking octopus on the TV. Very good. Right. Another one. They are sitting on the, on the cooler. They are sitting on the coolers. Very good. They are sitting on the coolers. And all of them have, right? Todos tienen hieleras. Ninguno se ha añado. They're not. Um, they, they haven't. They haven't. Taken a shower. They haven't taken a shower, right? No, no, no han tomado, no han tomado una ducha. 
they haven't taken a shower. And they are all dirty. They are messy. Messy significa desordenados. They are messy. No messy, the player, right? Messy is desordenado. Messy. So messy. the dog, the dog <laughs> is <laughs> the dog is eating pizza with chopsticks. They are wearing pajamas. She's cooking octopus on the TV. And for sure, they are sitting on. They are sitting on the coolers. They are sitting on the coolers. And that's it, right? It was a very crazy picture, the one that we had here. Oh, my dear class, thank you very much for collaborating with the sentences. I am going to see you tomorrow for your presentations. Remember to send me the picture with the progress, okay? Pongan la foto con su progreso en el chat. ¿Para qué me sirve? Para tener el segundo backup de que ustedes ya terminaron todo, okay? Have a beautiful night, and I'm going to see you tomorrow for the next class. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Take care.